Hey, greetings everyone. This is Briz. Hey, it's November 10th. It's uh, Veterans Day weekend. Just want to say thank you to all the veterans that have served your country. And uh, what we'll be doing today is uh, trying out my new mount that I can use in the vehicle uh, to record some video. A couple weeks ago at the Frankenstein ham radio special event station on the way home I had this uh, deer that ran out in the road and instead of crossing the road started going in front of me and I must have stayed behind the deer for at least 40 yards and I thought wow I missed an opportunity to get the video so in just a few moments I'm going to show you what I have set up it's it's a uh, kind of a makeshift deal but it's, it's the vacuum uh, mount for my G, one of my GPS's. Okay, I'm not sure if the light is all that great in here. But this piece here, I have a uh, double-sided smooth base that's always been attached to my, uh, my d dashboard. And then this piece here has got this, the uh, suction cup. And then, of course, this part here is on a ball and swivel. And then I took my normal backpacking tripod and just used the Velcro straps to hold that on there. And then, of course, my camera will set up here. So uh, let's get it hooked up and head down the road and check out to see if there's any vibration that will be uh, distracting. I guess in the future, if I start to utilize this more and more I may have to just find out if I can actually keep the battery charged while I'm actually shooting video uh, I do see a little bit of camera vibration so uh, there's a possibility this may not work but enjoy the ride we're in a small bedroom community of Jefferson City. A little town called Taos. Taos, Missouri. And it's got a population of uh, give or take 50, probably around 900. Good results out of pre 
Here it is, November 10th, and it's been a good 10 days since the hurricane on the northeast coast, and fuel has been hovering ever since at $3.19 a gallon for regular and unleaded premium. of the young kids you had working for you. 
because the word would get out that man they're really cleaning the windshields good up at Larry's Amico. Of course back then it wasn't Larry's Amico and I can't recall the guy's name now. <clears throat> I think his first name was Don. No, I can't think of what his last name was now. So you really got the full full deal when you went to a full serve station back in the old days. They check your tire pressure, your oil level, and clean your windshield mirrors and headlights. <laughs> and guess what folks? We're back home. And I hope you enjoyed your trip to Jefferson City and back.